All right, Cameron, thank you very much. And with this harsh winter system approaching, the Oregon Department of Transportation does want you to be vigilant out on the roads this weekend. And in some areas, they're even cautioning you against going out. Our KZI 9 News reporter Aaron Ariana was live at the ODOT maintenance yard in Springfield. Now, Aaron, what areas are ODOT warning uh, drivers against going this weekend? Well, Adam, they're definitely keeping an eye on those higher elevations. Right now, we're live outside the maintenance yard from ODOT in Springfield. This is where they operate and, and work on their vehicles, including some snow plows, one of several in the region. But like I said, that they're going to be working with the city of Eugene and Lane County to make sure that those roads are going to be clear of any ice or snow this weekend. But it is those mountain passes they're keeping an eye on, and they say, ODOT says, that they could be treacherous this weekend. They're monitoring the snow and heavy winds predicted, and they say that it will be very challenging for the snowplows to really keep up with the weather due to the freezing winds possibly pushing the snow off the roads. But they're keeping an eye on the Willamette Pass, the Santium Pass, and even I-84. ODOT spokesperson Mindy McCart says uh, anyone thinking of going to or from eastern Oregon should really consider delaying any weekend travel. You know, these kinds of conditions are likely to make travel difficult to impossible in certain areas and at certain times. Uh, so again, rescheduling those weekend travel plans may be your best option. Uh, road and weather conditions can change so quickly. She also says anywhere across Oregon as the storm comes in can really affect other areas. For example, if you're heading to the coast, they'll be checking on any uh, slides or down trees as this harsh weather comes inland and she says that ODOT crews are prepared for this weekend but they did experience some budget shortfalls this past couple months uh, in terms of ODOT funding so I asked her that question with that in play how really ready are you guys this weekend and you'll have her detailed answer coming up at 6 30 right now reporting live in Springfield Aaron Ariano KZI 9 News all right, Aaron, I'm going to keep you here for a second because uh, Cameron, our meteorologist, has a question for you really quick. So, Aaron, I know that you talked to her earlier and we saw what you just spoke about, but did you happen to hear anything about any of the timing surrounding their protocols for getting ready for this weekend? Because it looks like it's going to be a really difficult timing situation moving forward. All I know is that they're gearing up all day today and they're just going to be ready for tomorrow, those snow plows. And they want everybody to know that when they, when people see those snow plows out and about throughout the weekend to just, you know, don't drive past them on their right. That is illegal. But all I know for now is that they're going to be red, reading these uh, heavy machinery all day and all through the weekend. Cameron, Adam.